This morning has been off to a very rough start. She's asleep, so I have like an hour. That means basically to set up the rest of the day for hopefully a refresh. So I just quartered a bunch of grapes. I'm gonna put these in the freezer for her. I used my little grape quarterer. quarterer. I'm going to prep her snack spinner for outside because this is really nice because it can be closed and not have to worry about bugs getting in. For her water, I'm gonna put it in her little thermos I have. I have a shower curtain liner that I bought as like an activity area for the deck. So I'm gonna open that up and set it up. I made jello last night. Well, it's like gelatin. I definitely messed up and there's not enough, <laughs> but I do have that for the activity area. I'm gonna just put out like little containers with water. We're not doing a full on pool day today, but there will be like water. I also froze a bunch of animals. She really likes just this kind of ice stuff. And then I'm also trying to like prep the food, prep her lunch, prep, make myself lunch. It's been a rough morning. I'm hoping that once she gets outside, she cools off a lot because yeah. I'm here for a very, very, very quick update. I didn't even do anything yesterday. Like I haven't vlogged at all. She really liked the gelatin activity. I just bought like clear gelatin. I didn't buy Jello because I think Jello has sugar in it, which makes it stickier. It was quite messy, but she really enjoyed it. Today I'm going to regret this, but I'm going to make taste safe mud for her and like make like an animal washing station, which who knows how this is going to go. Let's just put it this way. I'm not putting her in her, my favorite feeding suit of hers. <laughs> taste safe mud. I don't really know the measurements. I'm just going to eyeball it. It's cocoa powder, cornstarch, and water just mixed together. Yeah, I gotta do that really quick so that I have time to like eat and set up the outside before she wakes up. So I'm in a rush. So I thought I'd show you the setup really quick. <laughs> so <laughs> here it is. I just kind of mixed the three ingredients together until it was a texture I liked and I didn't make it too much. That was a big thing. And then I just put some random water stuff around it for cleaning and digging. In her water table today, I kind of set it up with a bunch of Disney stuff. I think she'll like that. And then this is my place. And then out here, I've been putting her thermos because it stays cold. And then her snack spinner is actually perfect for outside because it can be closed and she can like spin it and pick what she wants. Her table and chairs she's been liking. I have my big umbrella. And then I also potentially might turn on this, the sprinkler. We'll see. We'll see how that goes and how hosed down she needs to be. Good morning. I am on my way to go food shopping. JB just left to go to my parents' house for the day. I'm very tired. <laughs> I guess we're having like a very big heat wave right now. So we've been outside all day, every day on the deck, which has been so nice. She's been very good at like entertaining herself. The mud thing yesterday was great. It was not as messy as I expected, which was great and she really enjoyed it. So I definitely could easily do it again. Today, besides food shopping, of course, lots of laundry. <laughs> I feel like I, I do laundry, like I do have like one day a week where I just like fold all the laundry at this point. I want to try to edit my first clutter video, but I'm also hoping to film the eyeshadow palette to clutter video. So we'll see how that goes. We both had our state inspections this week for the cars. And I don't think there's ever been a year where both of us passed without needing like a group. So that happened this year and that was very exciting. I feel like I told you guys we were thinking about Sesame Place. We now officially like have it planned. We got season passes, so we're gonna go a couple times, but we're definitely going to at least go once in the summer, once for the Halloween event and once for the Christmas event. If we feel like we wanna do more, it's obviously available, but we got like the pass where you don't have to pay for parking, which that was probably the best choice. I think that's all the updates for right now.
So I've been keeping pretty busy. I got my bronzer to clutter done, like the editing and everything. I got some laundry folded. I got some of it put away. I'm got to run up and switch it around again to do more, but I just filmed my eyeshadow palette declutter and it's a lot. And now I have to go into my spreadsheet and this is what takes the longest is going through and removing everything, but especially my eyeshadow palettes, I have every single individual pan in there and I have to go through and make sure I remove each one, which that will be interesting. But I'm happy and I'm excited with the way it looks right now. Right now I'm wearing the Citrine palette from Aether. I'm obsessed with it and I can't stop wearing it. I have a lot of work ahead of me with that this declutter but i'm hoping by the end it really relieves my stress a lot because i just i have clutter everywhere and i just want it gone and this is like the beginning of my 12-step program i am about to prep a sheet pan recipe i found online i can link it down below it's a teriyaki chicken recipe with like chicken and some vegetables that you throw in a pan and hopefully it cooks and then i'm also on the side going to make some of this rice ramen and that's the plan. I'm officially trying something I've never done before, but I am soaking my fruits using a little bit of vinegar. I like looked online for how to do this properly. And I'm hoping this makes them last longer because I'm very tired of throwing away food. Everything is so expensive and I just want to make the stuff last. And I'm trying to also have the option where like, if I know it's getting towards the end, I freeze it instead of just having to throw it away. So let's see if this is <laughs> successful. So. This is the, sh the recipe ready to go in the oven. I just cleaned the blueberries. I'm working on the strawberries. I also have grapes, but I don't think I'm gonna have time to do the grapes before she gets home and I have to really get involved with dinner. But I've had a pretty productive day, which has been nice. So I have a couple packages to show you guys. Um, Amazon Prime Day was this week. I have one thing that came from Prime Day already. The other thing I have was something we ordered last week. So what we ordered last week is our car seat is black and it gets so hot in the sun and so like the straps and everything so i thought there must be something to like protect the car seat and it's literally like almost like one of those things you would put on your windshield but it just kind of covers the car seat so i didn't get one for each car i just figured whatever car we're using with her that day if it's really sunny we'll just throw it on then my first prime day purchase that i was so excited about this 32 piece set from magnetiles i've actually had this in my save for later and every week i like check the price to see if it's on sale because this is a 50 dollars set and i'm just like I'm not trying to pay 50 dollars for magnetiles and it was on sale for 35 dollars. and my mom actually got the same set for her house i'm not going to be giving this to phoebe yet here we do have two like 15 piece sets so we do have some here and I'm trying to slowly grow, grow her collection, but I wanted to grab this when it was on sale for a later date. And then I have a Kohl's order here. So if you saw our last vlog for our deck, I got Phoebe this little table and chair set. It was $45, which I think is a lot of money for that set, but it was like, I couldn't find anything anywhere. So like beggars couldn't be choosers. I really do like it. It's used every single time we're on the deck, but it was $45 and it was $50 for free shipping at Kohl's. So I looked at the sale items and I grabbed a couple things. First, I grabbed her a pair of jean shorts. So Phoebe doesn't fit in any of her jean shorts except one pair that has a drawstring. So like, I thought we had more shorts that than we actually actively have for the summer because they don't stay on her. Now these are from Jumping Beans and they're the 24 month size, but they have a drawstring if they are too big. So I'm hoping that this will now give us an extra pair of pants in our rotation. And then this is a 3T, yeah, and it's a Elsa long sleeve shirt for fall or winter, whenever she fits in the 3T, but yeah, it's really actually very cute. It has like sequins on it too. The softest tea brand that they sell, like in the Disney department at Kohl's is really honestly very good. And that's my mini haul. Now I have a lot of cleaning to do, especially after dinner. Honestly, the dinner wasn't the greatest. The chicken was very dry and I'm not somebody who complains about chicken being dry and it was like, I don't know, it would need to be, I think it needs to be marinated a lot longer. Like it doesn't really say to marinate the chicken and I did it, but only for like a short period of time it was marinating and I think it needs to marinate for a while to not be so dry. It was kind of a flop. The berries though are all clean. I'm gonna do the grapes next. The grapes have a little bit different directions. I'll link the article I found that I'm basing this all off of. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna do the grapes tonight. I'm kind of tired. The grapes might wait till tomorrow. So Phoebe had an early morning today, which means her nap starts early, which means like everything is on a bit of an early schedule. I'm gonna start setting up the outside stuff today. I have like three kind of water stations set up. 
that I'm going to do with three different activities. I'm going to try to time lapse it, but this time of day there's not a lot of shade, so my camera might overheat. So I'm going to try to like find a shady spot from the fence and try to time lapse me setting this up. And then I'll show you guys the three activities I kind of just like made up in my head. They're nothing super fancy, honestly. <laughs> Okay, so there's three setups. Over here I have zoo animals. So I put some in her water table and some in this little activity table. And I also hid some in old Easter eggs. So there's all different kinds of sinking and floating animals. Over here I did kind of another sink and float thing. I put in some blue food coloring to make the water blue and there are fish at the bottom. So all the fish are sink toys and all the ducks are float. And I have a net here if she wants to scoop them up. And then over here I have pom-poms that she can transfer if she wants, different things to transfer them with. We'll see how it goes. I'm trying something new a friend recommended to me and it's freezing watermelon. So I'm just sticking it on little popsicle sticks and putting it in the freezer. I also cut up some grapes for the freezer as well. This kitty cat toast, we've done it before. It's like a little idea I found on Instagram. There's a lot. You wanna help me try it? You take this one. Can you carry that one? Let's go over to the camera. My mail opener is here to help me open some of our Appen salad packages from Amazon Prime Day. And she has an elephant in hand. First, you want to pull this out? Ooh. These are your clothes. I got a Carter's outfit set for fall. So the shirt has some cheetahs or something. And these are your pants. You like it, peeps? Little pants. And what's this one? This is another shirt that can go with it. It has little stripes. We got that for fall. This I was very excited about. They're diaper covers. Ready? They're little covers for your diaper. They're different colors of gray. I was very excited because these things are so hard to find at an affordable price. And I was able to get a set kind of a size bigger than she's wearing right now. I'm gonna open this box next. Yeah. Okay. All right. Help me open. Oh, open. Ooh, this one's for mama. Ooh, what is it? Is it colorful? This is the Amika Dry Shampoo. This was on sale for, I think, 18. I just had a free sample of it. I used it in my last empties, and it made me realize how much I love it. I was excited to see it on sale. It was the only, like, beauty sale that excited me. You ready for the big box? This one's heavy. <gasps> What's that, Phoebe? <gasps> what is it? Do you know what that is? Is that for Phoebe? Should we open it? She's like onto the next thing. Oh wow, it came with like a little carrying case. I got her a new pack of clips, her clips that she's wearing for the set was on sale. Oh my goodness. And I went and there was like a sort of like matching set on sale and I was like, I'm literally always losing them. So I would love to have some extras. So I can link both sets down below. Oh my goodness, you are so busy. Are you so busy? Wow, what do you have? So she grabbed a coffee, I grabbed a coffee. What's that? Should we open it? What should, I don't know what it is. Hmm, oh. These are little silicone cupcake molds. Oh, are they so many colors? Do you want me to open them? Yeah. I thought you might like these too. <laughs> for me and for you. We can share them. These run sale for like $3, that's a really good price. Then I think these are also our silicone baking mats. We have a two pack of these. And this set that was on sale was like a bunch of different sizes and we use them literally every time we bake now. <gasps> oh, what is that? That's for you. Is that cool? Is that the biggest you ever saw? Oh, anyway, this was three different sizes. So we're kind of hoping that the smallest size might fit in our toaster. And this might fit on our smaller baking sheet. And this is like the same size as our others. They're so cool. Anyway, we've like stopped needing to use aluminum foil completely for baking since getting this. Yeah. And then this is, this is one of Phoebe's favorite foods. Is this for Phoebe? Do you think this is for Phoebe? 
The mother load. Wow. It was four dollars for this. Uh, yeah, it's like four dollars yeah. to buy a regular bag of chips. Uh, yeah, it, yeah, is yeah. this would you like to try one? Yeah. Yeah? Phoebe's favorite food are pretzels. Oh. We might need Dada. Dada! Help! We need help! Can you open this? I don't know if my palm strength isn't wide enough to get it started. Good morning. Uh, Daddy's gonna help. I promise. He's gonna open it. Phoebe's very excited. She like, her jaw dropped when she saw it. Uh, Are you excited? He's opening. Uh, she also likes the color of the cupcake mold. I saw that you, somebody like froze like whipped cream for like a little like outdoor summer treat in one of these. And I thought that was really cute. But just like freezing anything in them would be nice. Even yeah. like just little pieces of fruit. You wanna try one? Oh, <gasps> Daddy. Daddy opened it. Oh my goodness. How cool is that? <laughs> I love you. That was almost everything. There's a couple things still left, but this is almost everything. Maybe there's only one thing left. But I don't think it's coming till next week. But yeah, that was our Amazon Prime Day haul. Well, good evening. I am pouring myself a glass of wine. I'm actually in the process of cleaning grapes. I actually have a bunch already drying. I split it into two batches. And I was laughing because I haven't worn this shirt in a while. I just kind of randomly found it in the back of my closet. And I remember many, many years ago on my channel, I was accused of being a sexist who hated men because I wore the shirt, so. To sexism. Tomorrow morning, Scott and his mom are taking Phoebe to a playground together and I'm going to film a video. And in the afternoon, we're meeting at his sister's house because there's a block party in her area that we're gonna go to for a little. Sunday morning is our two year uh, marriage anniversary and <laughs> We're gonna go see Thor in the afternoon. My parents are gonna watch Phoebe so we can go see the movie. And that's our weekend plans. <clears throat> Good morning. Scott's on his way back from the playground right now. I just got a video filmed and some laundry stuff done. I'm about to try to do the dishwasher before they get back, but it was so funny this morning. I said, Phoebe, do you wanna go to the playground? She jumped off the couch and went, yeah! <laughs> I guess you want to go. So Phoebe's down for her nap, so I'm going to set up the deck. And we're not going to do water today since we're going out in the afternoon. And it's actually going to be a cloudy day. It's still going to be really hot, but it's going to be cloudy. So I'm just going to set, set up some sand outside for her. I have two containers of my homemade sand. I actually have more that I could make, but I just haven't had the time. I did see online that if you add cinnamon to sand, it keeps the bugs away. Which is obviously concerned when this is all literally just ground down snacks. So I'm going to add cinnamon and see if that actually does work. Um, I have her farm and her farm animals that I'm gonna do today for the sand activity. And yeah, I'm just gonna go out and set it up. I don't think I'm gonna time lapse it because it's not gonna be very exciting, but I'll show you guys what it looks like because I don't even know what I'm doing. So on this side of the deck, I just have her little Fisher Price farm. It's an older model that we got on Marketplace just set up and there's extra animals there if she wants to add them. And on this side, I have the sand. This should be shaded by the time she comes out, but I just divided the sand equally between these three containers and put stuff in and then I put one of her little dump trucks here full of shovels and all different kind of things that she can play in the sand with and I have no idea how this is gonna go but I did add cinnamon to each batch so hopefully that keeps the bugs away I guess today was a good day but it was a long day so after she played with sand we came inside for a little and we got her ready to go to Scott's sister and brother-in-law's house. And that was a nice time. They had a slip and slide there. Phoebe had no interest in it. She doesn't seem to like sprinkler type of things. It's weird because like, even if a sprinkler is like just doing like a very, un, a very predictable, just like motion, she's still very nervous around it. However, she loves being squirted and sprayed aggressively by the hose. So I don't understand how those are different. There was a little block party over there and that's kind of why we went over and there was a little bouncy house. There's a large bounty, bouncy house and there was a little one. So everyone was on the large one. So Phoebe got this tiny little, little tykes bouncy house all to herself. It was her first time on one. Yeah, that might've been her favorite moment of life, I think. And we're going to my old employer slash my dad's employer's 
family day this coming weekend and I'm pretty sure there's going to be bouncy type of things there. So she'll get to do that again soon. It was really cute though. Like it was pretty small. I'm pretty sure you can just like get it yourself. Like it's something like rent. It's so weird because just now I saw like on Facebook Marketplace, someone in the area was selling theirs for like $40. And I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. Now I'm gonna eat dinner because I have not eaten. Oh my God, I went with Phoebe. She like woke up from her nap at 10 o'clock, which is very early. And I was like, um, how are we gonna make it to even like seven o'clock tonight? Somehow we did. She didn't sleep on the way home, which was a, which was a miracle. I was like, we were all hot and sweaty. And I was like, you know what? Waffles and fruit it is. And that's what we did. And I may have popped the waffles with a few M&Ms. Sometimes we offer her popsicle baths, which have been really great because she gets a popsicle, but also I don't have to deal with a mess. And she picked the popsicles I made a couple of vlogs ago. So it was almost like she kind of had banana and yogurt for dinner because that's all the popsicle was made of. So she ate today. Fed is best. Phoebe woke up pretty early today again. And I realized I forgot to freeze more watermelon. Scott's sister gave us all this watermelon at our house yesterday so that we could freeze more for Phoebe. And I just have a bunch of like literal random popsicle sticks that are empty that I'm gonna put on. So if you're wondering how I do this, it is quite a science. I take a piece of popsicle and I shove a stick through it. Ooh, that one did not go through beautifully. There we go. Ta-da! I don't know if this actually helps, but I'm gonna put a piece of wax paper in between so they don't freeze together. And there you have it. Phoebe and Scott, Dada, just got back from the playground and Phoebe hey. is doing her paint with water farm book. How's your day? How's your week? It was fun. We, we had fun at the, we went to a new playground this morning. It was a little far, but it was fun. It's probably about the same distance as the one yesterday. What is it? Who is that? I'm gonna go see Thor today. This is my Avengers shirt. And I got my Thor socks. You can't see. Let's see them. Thor. It, says, it even says love, Thor. Like love and thunder? I guess. Okay. Well, I'm gonna stop <laughs> vlogging now. Phoebe is here to help us open our last Amazon package. Wow. <laughs> She's throwing it wow. all over her. Oh, wow. This is so cool. We got these LED strips. Wow. <laughs> For this one spot at the bottom of our steps where we can't like plug in a light. And these are like rechargeable strips that you can put under a, Whoa, like a cabinet, like in your kitchen, but we're gonna put them underneath the like railing of the staircase. This? And they're motion activated and rechargeable. And those are swim diapers. Do you see a seal? What does he say? Those were not on sale, but we needed them. Oh, you see the crab? What does the crab do? So we can oh, let you know oh, if oh, these oh, work oh, out oh, for oh, what we're looking for. Cause and what's that? I always have to turn on my phone like flashlight at night seal? because I don't want to turn the hall, or, or, the hall or, or, light or, or. because it like shines light in her room under the door. Her nose? So I'm hoping this will help me not miss a step slash step it's on so cattails. A star? You see a Today star? since we're going to take her to my parents around 130 since we're seeing the movie I just set up the sand again but with dinosaurs today and it sounds like dinosaur is it sounds like the dinosaur theme is a hit. So, wow, fun. Okay, you say hello. Hi. Uh. We saw Thor: Love and Thunder. Meant to take the video. There was a kids' clothing thrift store, so Phoebe's very excited to see what we got. Yeah. So we got this shirt that has penguins on them. What do you think of the penguins? Do you like the penguin shirt? So we got that. And these are just a pair of navy blue leggings. These are pants. Baby, put your pants on, right? We got this little Mario shirt. Do you like the Mario shirt? You like that? That's pretty cute, isn't it? I thought you would like that. This one is a Minnie Mouse sweatshirt. You see the Minnie Mouse? You like that? That's a good one. Some polka dot jeans. Got some pants, more pants. Oh. This one, this is the shirt Daddy picked out. It has unicorns. What's a unicorn say? 
<laughs> Daddy picked out some shoes. It'll be a while till you grow into them, but Daddy picked out these little sneaks. Daddy picked out shoes. What do you think? Whoa. What do you think? Do you like it? I think that's a really good ending to the video. Do you want to say goodbye to the video? Can you wave and say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Can you say bye-bye? You being silly? What if we say boo? Can you say boo to the video?